Hello everyone, welcome to God of War. Not in, in a playthrough standpoint. I might I might do a playthrough of this game. I kinda doubt it. <coughs> it's all dependent on how I feel. Yep. Well, we're gonna play through my playthrough of the game. Um and I'm I'm not be I have not beaten the game yet. This is uh pretty much all this is. By the way, there will be spoilers. There how already you know, will be spoilers. I'm pretty far in the game. So don't watch this if you're going to end up playing the game any farther past this point. Alright, do not watch past this loading screen. Uh, or you'll get spoiled for the game. But if you do not care, you're welcome to continue watching. Um, I won't be doing any story stuff. I'll actually be doing um, some side stuff. Because I want to do that. Unless I'm forced into story stuff, which is which is possible, it's possible. Um, but remember, spoilers. All right. Spoilers ahead. So, as you can probably see, I'm I'm pretty far. All right. Uh, we've gotten the we're up to the um the. Return to the Summit mission. So that's fun. Uh, we're going to be going up to uh, Yotaheim. That's for me. That's fun. Uh, but rather than doing that, we're going to do some of these side stuff. Like uh, favors or... Heck, even with some of these treasure maps, if I'm feeling it. Sorry, I don't have that. I kind of got a little bit of a cold. Um, my apologies. Um, so, yeah. Uh, let's, I guess, I could show you the level ups. I've fully leveled up the Leviathan Axe up to this point. Uh, I'm about halfway done the, the Guardian Shield part. The Blades of Chaos, which you don't get until a little far in. I'm you know, halfway leveled up. Love the item, though. Love these things. Really one of my favorite. And then with the Talon Bow, I'm actually about to finish him right now. Like, as we speak, we're about to finish him. So that's awesome. So now that's completely leveled up. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna put the rest in the, um, these random things that I'm not actually reading. I just wanna le level them up. Because by the end of the game, I'd like to be fully leveled up, that kind of idea. This, um, if you're wondering, this is more of just a gameplay show-off thing, to say the least. It's not going to be a, um, a whole series quite yet, quite yet. But do remember that this is, um, something. So that's cool. Yeah. I think we're going to go here. Uh, remove for his collection, treasure filled storerooms. And I'll be able to, you know, show off fighting people and that kind of stuff. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm like halfway through the game, I'm pretty sure. You know what? Hold on. I gotta turn this volume down. Turn it just a, just a bit down, you know, because we don't want it being too loud. Because that's just ridiculous. And I'll have to turn those in. Turn those up later. Um. Yeah, this is. I like this game a lot. Uh. I'd say it's really good. Now my question is, how does one get over there? Hmm. I don't know, but we're going to travel to home. Where the game starts... Well, the, the game doesn't start there. It actually starts um, a little out. Right, are you going to do this? Oh, no. It does this thing sometimes where it just likes to stand there. Um, so that's oh fun. Maybe I can fly. What, no, what he's talking no. about is... God's two must stay on the path. I promise you. The, yeah, no, this is more spoilers. Yeah, mm-hmm. 
did they come from? They are my burden from a life that is behind me. Well, they're in my life too. And I'd like to hear that story. Those days are dead. To relive them is needless. painful. Okay. How can it be needless if it's the truth? Can you be like One go day, and jump? You will understand. The fast travel thing way. here is it's really it's really it's really long, but it's we jump. It's definitely. Really? Oh dear. Definitely a lot quicker than just running there. Because half the time, I don't even know where I'm going. Bad idea! And if you're wondering, he says bad idea every time, and it kind of gets annoying. You know, um, let me, I will might as well say some things I think about uh, this game. I think this game's great, and I love it. It's definitely a challenge um, that I wasn't expecting. But now that I know that it's a thing, I really enjoy it. Um... And I know that I'm very excited to play through the rest of the game that we still have. There's a thing there. Oh, that's just a shot. That's just it's shining off. I'm just really excited for the entire game to finish up, and I want to see how it's gonna finish up and how everything's gonna like be. You know, that kind of idea. That kind of idea. So we actually want to head. I mean, I guess we could head, um, isn't there something over here? There's four Valkyries in Midgard. I didn't know that. That's uh, definitely some information I should know, but don't know. Um, yeah, I love this game uh, so far, and I think it's it's good. It's a, it's a 9 out of 10 for me so far, unless it just takes a random turn that I absolutely hate for some reason. Which, so far, nothing like that's happened, so... I can't be mad. I'm not sure if this is the right direction to where I want to go. I'm hoping it is. Because if it is, then... Yay. But if it's not, then... Oh no. You know? <laughs> the knuckle. Oh no! This is... The beginning of the game. Like, the right over here is... Huh. Cause I remember, oh, woo, I remember going through this part of the game. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, no, we're definitely, uh, it's definitely the way to this tight area, because these are level 5 and 4. So, the combat compared to the other, um, God of War games up to this point is... It's like way different. It's a lot more strategic, I think, rather than tactical, which I personally like. It's I don't get me wrong, I love the normal God of War games, um, but I would say that I like this combat and just that much more. Um, and there's two there's two different weapons here. We have the axe that is the weapon you normally get. The one that you get at the beginning of the game, and then you have the uh, chaos blade that you get at just about the middle of the game. I just died. Uh, about the middle of the game, uh, which aren't as strong quite yet for me because I just got them and I got to level them up and that kind of stuff. But they're very, they're very strong um, for times being. Um, I would say that they're probably. Um, gonna be extremely useful later on. Like right now, they're great. I mean, they're not the best weapons, but they are definitely amazing. Um, a mechanic in this game is the, is the weird grab. I will put exactly what I call it. The weird grab. The weird grab is this thing where um, you have to get the enemy. To get up his uh, meter, his, um, stun meter, and once you have full stun on, then once they get fully stunned, then you can grab them and instantly kill them. Well, instantly kill them depending on the enemy. Like there's a boss or something. Normally, it's just a grab and do like a bunch of damage. But if it's a uh, 
normal enemy, it's it's gonna die. So that, you know, sounds good, but I wouldn't say go after it as the main like thing. And then there are runes, which are upgradable things that you can put on your weapons that give you special abilities. <coughs> you can find these throughout your journey, and they're extremely, extremely useful. Um, Nicely done. And they're great. They're great to have. They truly, truly are. Um, and I would say that you really need to aim to to really get those. Like you really want them. You should really want them. I feel like I'm heading in the wrong direction. Now, do I feel it? I know it. Hmm. Something's wrong. Something's definitely not right. Hidden chamber. We are going to head there. That's where we're going to head. To the hidden chamber. Yep. To the hidden chamber. So I think we have to go through here. Uh, the hidden chamber. Ch chamber. 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 Traver uh, is actually, I think, between like going farther through this area. I might be wrong, but I think that's it. Remember, I haven't played through this game completely, and I'm still learning more things about it he here and there. Like, you know, when I learned that we get the Chaos Blades, I was hyped up. I was very excited. I think the areas scale with you. Not the areas. Like, uh, sometimes we'll see enemies that just randomly pop up. I think they scale. With you. Or at least when you know you're going through an area again. They will scale. That's the, I don't know what I should call it, but... Um, yeah. And I really like the puzzles of it. With the whole, um... The idea of the whole axe allowing you to freeze things. I really like that idea. Um, hmm, hold on. Where does this put us? I think it puts us right outside the gate. Which is... Where? Behind me? Like over here somewhere? Maybe it's up here. Because I don't remember where this is. This was... I played through this part of the game yesterday. Oh, it is right here. Oh, wow. I was not ready for that. Don't... I'm playing on uh, Give Me a Challenge difficulty, not a, you know, the God of War difficulty, because that's too much for me <laughs> for starting out. Um, but it's... Definitely a challenge, and that's like no joke. Um, I don't think games are all that difficult normally, but this is definitely something you need to watch out for. Well, it might just be that I'm playing on Give Me a Challenge difficulty, which is the second hardest difficulty in the game, but or, unless there's a random difficulty that's called God, Give Me the God of War, God of War, you know. Um, then this is the second hard thing. Um, yeah. I was just going to play on um, Give Me a Balance Experience. And then I was persuaded by my good fellow Brandon, who you might know from streams. You know, he persuaded me to play on Give Me a Challenge mode. And it was a horrible yet great idea at the same time. Yep. That's all I have to say about that. Also, I kind of hate the fact that we have to run so far. But that doesn't really matter. Um, I guess I'll take these out. The here. I'm not gonna actually switch it out. Switch it out. Wow. See, like, I just got comboed there when I was trying to block. It is brutal. Try to take Mr. Uh, Fast Boy out here, Mr. Boy RD. Oh 
what? I just gun didn't last long enough. Dang it. I mean, I'm also gonna... I... How I'm recording this, you know, how I record videos, it's not normally how I play this game. I actually stand right in front of the screen. Or sit right in front of it, depending on how I feel. Um, and it's... It's good. It's good. It is good. And we're gonna try to beat these guys, and then we're gonna open the secret door. And then I'm gonna leave it, whatever, behind it, up to your imagination. And this, I think, will be the final... Uh, filler episode. Uh, that I have to record, anyways. I've recorded all of the rest, yes. Including... Minecraft. Yeah, I, I know. If this goes up before Minecraft, uh, tell my wife and kids I love them. Because that that was a fun playthrough of a, of something that didn't actually last a full playthrough or anything like that. It only lasted for a few minutes, thankfully. <laughs> That's all I can handle in Minecraft for a um for a YouTube experience. If it was for my own accord, I I could probably play it for a little bit longer. See, I don't think I think Minecraft is one of those games that you can really play by yourself, but to play it online is it, it's sad. I think. I definitely feel like like I'm actually doing damage to guys in game with all these um, all these attacks. So I can feel like I can feel the pain break on them. Cool, that was great. Now let's open this up. It is over. This is a thing that you get uh, way later in the game. Um, right before the Blades of Chaos. Um, I'm not going to just say how you get it, but, you know, to open these, you need to get through a good, like, half of the game. So, yeah. I can't believe it was next to Mother's Garden this whole time. No wonder we can never get in there. Well, hidden chamber of Odin. <sighs> Sorry if this was, you know, short uh, for you guys. You know, if you guys think this was shorter than usual, I just wanted a video to record a video so I could put it out and get it ready. My my thoughts and ideas of God of War. Um, what was that? I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel. Um, in the next episode, it will either be another filler episode, or if this is the last uh, filler episode that goes up, tomorrow will be the first episode of Dark Souls 1 remastered, and I'm excited. I'll see you guys then. Um, yeah. Peace.